So this is my Arduino uh, Arduino powered synthesizer thing. Uh, it has an eight step sequencer on it. Um, so yeah, basically it's just on a breadboard right now, but um, I've got an R2R attack going on here um, with eight bits flowing in from these pins. And then I've just got a little op amp here set to lower the voltage a little so I, I can get a better uh, line level output, it won't damage anything. Um, so I'll go ahead and play, uh, I believe the triangle wave is set right now. Okay, and then uh, I've actually got four oscillators on here, so we'll go to the sawtooth. Whatever that decides to upload. There we go. <clears throat> and here's the square wave. And finally, a sine wave. And then I can also go in and change the rate. So, I'll raise that by quite a bit here. Alright, so... That is pretty much it, uh, as far as the software side of things goes. Um, all that's really going on is uh, creating a, picking a wavetable to create at the beginning of the sketch, and then, uh, yeah, so I've got wavetables for each oscillator, and then uh, they have decimal values, and then I just go in here and convert that to binary and set eight. Uh, boolean variables and uh, then I've used uh, AVR Studio true C commands I believe they are called um, instead of digital rights because they are 10 times as fast so I would look into that if you don't already know what that is and you need uh, an alternative because digital right is slow um, and then here's my logic down here so uh, Fairly straightforward. I should probably split this up into libraries or something, but I'm not not there yet. Uh, still need to add a few more things in software. Um, but apart from that, the rest of it's going to be hardware. Um, going to be putting some high and low pass filters in that you can turn on or off, and uh, hopefully some analog filtering circuitry. Um, I'd like to have the just the the DDS really going on in here and then the rest of this be analog from there on out um, so and then you would just control your rate from here as well as your uh, frequency selection um, and I guess envelope as well uh, probably be easiest to implement here uh, but anyway that's about it thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned because I'm gonna be working on this guy <laughs>